Hey guys, uh, JD here. We are headed up to, uh, we are at Roosevelt Lake camping and uh, we're headed up to these cliff dwellings, uh, cliff dwellings, Tonto uh, National Monument. Um, right there. Pretty cool. We just uh, climbed up, I don't know. I'll bet we've hiked up about a, a thousand feet right now, Debbie and I. Oh, that's a de decent trail. But uh, we're a little winded. Um, I'll show you this here. If you want to pause and read it. But uh, the, the Salado Indians lived here. Uh, they uh, lived it from the 1400s. Where'd Debbie go? Oh, there she is. Hi. Show you this. Uh... Salado, I guess. Maybe Salado, Salado. Potato, potato. Well, you just follow up behind. Spectacular view here, view here. Look at this. There's, there's Roosevelt Lake. Campers down there. You can probably see it from here if we knew which one to point to. Absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous day. Uh, I think the temperature is probably 84. Probably 84 right now. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna shut up and. Just let you guys look at the at the ruins. You're on camera. Hi there. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Have a good one. What can you tell me? Tell, tell me about that. Oh, yeah, I can tell you a lot. Uh, do you want me to? <laughs> yeah, you can sure. YouTube. Well, yeah, you can take a look at uh, through the walk through the rooms here. I do ask the walls are super fragile, so as you do, you can avoid touching them. It helps preserve it. Uh, but yeah, the original roof in that room there. There's a roof in the other side there. Uh, you see the rooms that are uh, oh, geez, pretty really? much like one room apartments, so they're basically where you cook, yeah, sleep, that was, that was, and so each family had their own space. Okay. So, so how many people do you, do you think lived here at one time? Yeah, it's yeah. estimated. Would, would they come and go, or, or would they just like the same families? Do you think? Um, there were probably people going down to the fields for several weeks at a time in the summer, uh, but for the most part, people were here year-round. We think they're here for up to 100 years. You look at the amount of rooms, there's about 15 residential rooms. So four people per family, you think. That gives you 60, but probably less than that. Gotcha, uh, yeah. as as total. So, so now did they, did they have horses? Did no horses. horses. This is 1300, so it's pre-Spanish, so there's no horses, no um, you know, cattle, no livestock of any yeah. sort. They're farming corn beans and squash and cotton. So, so, you, so you think the latest, uh, what, what's the latest you think somebody inhabited these? Uh, well, about 1400 is what we estimate here because we don't find any newer artifacts in that. Yeah, do you all think maybe Jesse James was hiding out here sometime? Well, I mean, if he did, we don't know. <laughs> yeah, so, no, no evidence of that. But. Okay, cool. Yeah. Well, thanks, Eric. Yeah, yeah. No problem. Enjoy. Yeah. Any questions, let me know. Okay. Yeah.
guess those are doors we can't get in. vacation home view here. Second home. something maybe several days at least to carry them all back here so can I stop by you? Yeah. Hi girl. Hi. Okay. That's kind of some kind of little secret room with a smaller door. I don't know. Maybe they stuck the kids in there. Up here. The holes. The hole. Is that something that was done by them or by? No, that was done by us. The reason we did that is uh, before we did that, you could actually slide those in and out. And they just want to keep them in place. Eventually, they have some empty Debbie? Yeah. 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 That's right. Take your picture. Sit down and rest. How are you? Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Yeah. Just run down. Yeah. Yeah. You betcha. That's the uh, cliff dwellings of uh, Tonto National uh, Forest. Um, we'll talk to you later.